implement the following boolean function here the function is given that is f of a b c d is equal to pi 1 pi 12 15 these are nothing but max terms this pi indicates these are the max terms the input a b c are connected to the select lines of a t is to 1 mug so we supposed to implement this function using a t is to 1 mug so here this pi indicates the max term will try to represent the same function using min term that is i can represent this as f of a b c d is equal to i will represent it in min term form so the remaining the numbers which does not exist here those should be considered as the min terms so here the function consists of four variable the possible values are 0 to 15 so here 0 does not exist so we have to consider here 1 is here so in this group 2 3 4 is missing we supposed to consider here 2 3 4 pi is available here then we have to consider 6 to 11 that is 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 is here 13 14 so these are the min terms that is complement of max term are nothing but min terms now implementation of this is same as implementation of this min term so here it is said that a b c are connected to the select lines of a t is to 1 mux let me show you the block diagram of a t is to 1 mux this is the block diagram of a t is to 1 mux we supposed to consider the select lines so for a t is to 1 mux we have 8 inputs and 3 select lines here it is said that a b c should be considered as select lines so the function is having four variables the another variable is d that d we supposed to use it as input variable so now in 8 is to 1 mux let me consider this as d naught input d1 d2 input d3 d4 d5 this is d6 and this is d7 let me consider the output as y so for easy understanding it is better to write the truth table so here we have a b c input a b c are the select lines and we supposed to use d as a, a data line and this is y is the output let me write the truth table so here we have four variables the possible inputs are zero that is in binary 0, 0, 0, 0, 1 can be represented as 2, 0, 0, 1, 0, 3, 0, 0, 1, 1, 4, 0, 1, 0, 0, 5, 0, 1, 0, 1, 6, 0, 1, 1, 0, 7, 0, 1, 1, 1, 8, 1, 0, 0, 0, 9 1 0 0 0 9 1 0 0 1 0 11 1 0 1 1 12 1 1 0 0 13 1 1 0 0 14 1 1 1 0 and 15 as 1 1 1 1 so here the min term values are 0 2 3 it means that for these cell numbers the output is high so 0 2 3 4 this is 0 2 3 4 then we have 6 7 8 9 that is 6 7 8 9 then we have 10 11 13 14 10 11 13 14 for other cells the value is 0 so now here it is said that we supposed to use a b c as select lines that is a b c are select lines here we have to use d as a data line so here it is four variable function draw the table which consists of 16 cells so here we have 16 cells so here one row we will use with respect to the variable d bar another row i will use the variable d so here zero indicates the complement of d that is nothing but d bar and one indicates the direct variable that is d so here we'll assume these are the input lines d naught this is d1 d2 
d3 d4 d5 d6 and d7 d7 are the input lines that is these d0 to d7 are the input lines the same thing i have written here that we supposed to write here now here we can observe that for, for 0 2 4 6 8 10 12 14 the value is 0 so we supposed to consider the cell numbers for complement of d as 0 2 4 6 8 10 12 and 14 and here we can see that for cell number 1 3 5 7 9 11 13 and 15 value of d is 1 so this row indicates that value of d is 1 that is 0 1 2 3 5 7 9 11 12 13 14 and 15 this we have to write like this then the next step is for these mean terms the output is high that is for 0 2 3 4 for 0 output is high it means we have to put the circle here like this then we have 2 3 4 put the circle for 2 3 and 4 then we have 6 7 8 9 6 7 8 9 10 11 13 14 we have 10 11 13 14 so now after putting the circle like this now we have to write the input values of the mux so here the first column is d0 so d0 value is equal to here circle is given to 0 so 0 is with respect to d bar therefore the value of d0 is d bar like this and here d1 d1 is equal to so in d1 column circle is made for both the columns both the both the values so its value is d plus d bar that is d plus d bar which is nothing but 1 so next we have d2 d2 will be equal to circle is for first row which is with respect to d bar its value is d bar likewise d3 so its value is 6 7 both are circled so that is d plus d bar which is nothing but 1 so similarly d4 will be equal to 1 d5 is equal to 1 d6 is equal to here circle is for second row second row is with respect to d so d6 value is d and d7 value is again d bar now we have to consider these inputs for the 8 is to 1 max so now here we can see that for d0 d2 and d7 the input is d bar that is d0 d2 and d7 so here d0 d2 and d7 are shorted and its value it is connected to d bar let me consider this as d input pass through this inverter the output here is d bar it should be connected this is d bar it should be connected here therefore now we can say d0 is equal to d bar d2 is equal to d bar and d7 equal to d bar so d2 will be equal to d1 will be equal to 1 similarly d1 d3 d4 d5 are connected to 1 that is 1 3 4 5 1 3 4 5 so this is 1 3 we have 4 we have 5 so these all are connected to logic 1 which is nothing but plus 5 volt so similarly the remaining one is d6 which is connected to d input so remaining is d d6 which is connected to d that is it is connected to d input so thus it produces the output y so thus this is the implementation of given function using 8 is to 1 max thank you for watching